Welcome to Adult Bedtime Stories, the show that allows adults to have bedtime stories. It's the next step in ASMR, a way to sleep through storytelling. And today we're going to be reading Bear Feels Sad. I wonder how the bear's feeling. Probably sad. <clears throat> Shall we start? Lovely. <clears throat> when Bear feels sad, he is quiet and doesn't feel like smiling. Sometimes he even wants to cry. And as you can see there, a single tear is rolling down his cheek. Bear feels sad when he drops his jar of honey. Now, as you can see, I often eat honey in a meadow and get it all over my face, tripping on nothing, or spills his milk, still in the meadow. Bear is sad when he argues with his friend. He doesn't like it when they aren't nice to each other. Now, as you can see here, the teddy bear has a frog friend. Very interracial. Being sick makes Bear sad. Bear doesn't like staying in bed. He has to have medicine to make him better. He coughs and sneezes and has no energy to play. Getting hurt makes Bear very sad. When he bumps his head, it aches. He's bumping his head there on a branch, floating in midair. When he scrapes his knee, it hurts. When he stubs his toe, it throbs. I mean, that's very relatable. When I often stub my toe for pleasure, it throbs a lot. When he cuts his finger, it stings. I also assume that it bleeds stuffing, you know, the, the white cotton ball sort of stuff. Bear is sad when it's time to leave his friend's house. As you can see here, the bear's friend is a distorted pink elephant. I don't know if you can see that there. Uh, I'll describe it to you. So its face, ears, belly and ankles have all been maimed and ripped off and looked like it's been sewn back together by a maniac. Time to go home, Bear. Saying goodbye always makes Bear sad. When Bear is sad, there's nothing better than a hug from Mum. It always makes him feel happy again. And that's the end of the story. What have we learned from the story? You can always feel better if you have a mum. Some people don't, and they're sad for life. We also wonder what his mechanism for coping with sadness is going to be when he's older and has to leave Mama Bear's house. There's also Bear feels happy, Bear feels kind, Bear feels shy. If you want me to read them, leave a message in the comment going yes, I want you to read them. If you like the video, then like the video and don't forget to subscribe for more. And as we always say here, sleep well and good night.